Hello, hello. Hi, Audrey. Hi. Hey. <laughs> How are you? Good, thank you. I think I should turn on the video, right? I'm going to do that. If you want to, up to you. Yeah, that's okay. That's okay. Hi. <laughs> Hi. How's it going? How have, have you been? Good. good, good. Thank you. How are you doing? I'm very well. I'm very well. Yeah. Yeah. So <laughs> I wasn't really sure about the time. But when you said now, so I said, okay, let me just join in and find out, you know. <laughs> yeah, yes, I'm on now. Okay. Yeah. How have you been finding it? Do you have any um, questions? Stuck it's anywhere? really interesting. Um, at the moment, I am right now what I'm trying to do is to sort out the um the currencies because I've a few investments in different different currencies and, and the exchange rates and stuff like that. So I'm a, I'm I'm not very good in math, to be honest. <laughs> but but this is what is um, giving me that a uh, bit of confusion but i'm i've resorted to put everything in a book because again i'm not really good with the uh, <laughs> excel i almost I, I almost wanted to take a course uh with excel because of this course but i was like okay that will waste a lot of time so no. i'll just rather do the book and then yeah. when i whenever yeah. i'm ready i, I would uh, yeah but I, honestly i'm finding it really really interesting i'm looking at the um what i found the most interesting was the net worth I, I, you know calculating the assets and then I've never looked at it that way never looked at it that way before you know so it's been really eye-opening for me um and I'm catching up a lot because I'm I'm like di in different time zones yes so yeah. at every period of time so I, I happen to be a couple of days behind but I'm still gonna uh, work my way through I'm because I'm finding it really interesting and it's gonna really help me so yeah yeah so oh. far so yeah. Great, that's awesome feedback. Yes, I know it's a lot. Um, there's a lot to do, like back to back, right? Um, right. And I, I don't, I, I, I'm trying <laughs> not to overwhelm. Um, yeah, that's right. <laughs> too much steps um, in back to back, and that's why I kind of like cluttered it in in different places. And I put this um, mid break, right? Before okay. we start talking about investing and growing money. Right. money. Yes, so, yes. So, right. so far we've been talking about like laying like a foundation and mm -hmm. knowing mm -hmm. what our money is doing, where exactly right. it is, mm -hmm. um, and having an idea of how we would save it. And if we do have any debt, like just understanding what is the debt mm -hmm. and what, you know, what type of debt we, you know, what the person has or, you know, we have or anything. So that, you know, when we start deciding, okay, I want to grow my money, Right. Then you know, okay, I have an income. This is what I can do with it. Or right. I don't right. have an income, but I have all these great skills. I, I I'm good at teaching. I'm good at right. helping people. Or I'm good at answering surveys. You know, people make money online from answering surveys. I'm good at giving mm -hmm. feedback. Right. Uh, people make money from giving feedback. Um, and then you know, now using that in the next step, which is invest in growing our money. Right, right. So, well, I'm glad that you know <laughs> you've that one that you've got a book. But you yes, I've, I've got a book, <laughs> and and so what I've had to do is I've I put the stuff on the pieces of papers. So I've had I put it all in the book. Yeah, and yeah. it's helping me really look at it. You know in a bigger picture which is great you know so that's really helping and the and the decluttering as well <laughs> that's a big one. imagine how much junk i had you know wow I've, I've, I've given a few things away very recently and i've deleted some stuff on my phone and things like, and really it, it even helps you feel lighter you it know it really does it's amazing how <laughs> like what what is, you know and the thing is when you think about it some of the things you haven't used for the past three months you will not use it so, so I, this is really eye opening. It, it's just helped me to structure things, you know, mm. put things in, you know, you know, in perspective and in, you know, step by step process, you know. Yeah. And at the same time, it's not rushing, you know, but it's like I know what I'm doing in yeah, my mind yeah. because of the um, the videos each day. So some of the things I have in my mind already, and it's it's, it's an ongoing process, and others yes. I'll have to do the assignment straight away. So yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I'm really happy with it. Yeah. Oh, thank you. I'm glad that you are. Yeah. The decluttering for me was huge, um, and I and I and it you know it never ends. Like I have to keep on decluttering. Right. Um, yes. Absolutely. It, it never ends. But for me, when I was re a, a few years ago, when I started really decluttering, I was really financially stressed, and I was just thinking of 
for just different and my mind was always cluttered I was overwhelmed I'm thinking I'm not really mm-hmm. sleeping mm-hmm. and I'm like I just even can't even think about what right. I'm thinking it was just right. so many right. different things right and then I just stopped and I was just looking around my house I opened my cupboard to get some clothes I think I was taking my daughter to nursery then then she was still in nursery and oh, just to even find the clothes I was it took me like 30 minutes I was just like I can't even figure out what do I want to wear and I was just like okay fine I'll wear this outfit but the top was not was like worn out mm-hmm, and I was like mm-hmm. I can't even see the clothes I have I <laughs> yeah, and I'm I running know. late right and, right and so I, like I, I emptied so like I literally decluttered everything my mm-hmm. clothes my mm-hmm. shoes right I was right. giving them away people would ask me my husband's asked me but well, what if you need it I'm like right I can't even see it right now okay. I can't see it so right. I'm not right. going to use it and yeah. it, I actually haven't yeah and yeah. now that decluttering has moved into so I, I even decluttered his clothes he's so, mm-hmm. like anytime mm-hmm. I start seeing clutter in my mind I'm mm-hmm. like yes it has to go yeah because when I see like things like even when I go to the kitchen and I'm cooking and and, and I've cluttered my spice cupboard so I only right. have what I'm using right? right it's not like packed with packed up with random things that you don't even use you don't even know how long it's been there there's <laughs> little insects in there and you're thinking you, don't you know, know. It, it does help you you know it, it helps in every aspect of your life if you're able mm-hmm. to just declutter uh, household things declutter uh, uh, on your phone declutter even you know in your email and things like that you know yeah so and the thing is it, it does bother it, it bothers it's at the back of your mind yes. you don't realize yes. that that's what's even causing you some form of stress right it's right. adding to the stress mm-hmm. but you don't mm-hmm. realize it but it's there right and, and one thing that i found is that once you keep on seeing something, you mm-hmm. start imagining that that's how your life is. So right. like, if you keep on seeing, for example, you are always hanging out at the fanciest hotels with Bill Gates and Richard Branson and right, Zuckerberg, right. like all these, like the billionaires of this world, you start imagining that you're like a billionaire because they're all your friends. Like you see them all the time. Mm-hmm. When, if you keep on seeing clutter, you start imagining, well, you know, nothing can happen. Nothing can get through. Ugh, if nothing will work anyway. It is what it is. And it is what it is. And then when you start thinking about your career or your business or making more money, you start thinking the same thing. Well, it is what it is. Yep. You know, yep. Nothing can happen. And so you, you, you're not able to even think past a certain point. And so you get stuck in this cycle of the same thing. Your, your money comes and goes and money, you don't know what's happening with it, you know? Yeah. It's, it is what it is. There's no space. There's no yeah, room. Yeah. There's no yeah exactly and it's the same thing and so like now like my in my house we've um I've with my kids because I have kids and they're always playing mm-hmm. I constantly declutter their toys right. so I hide it and then after like six months I swap <laughs> I'll bring it back so the, the, it's like a new toy because right. they haven't okay. seen it in so long right so that it's not everywhere and then my husband does these things where he should tell, he tells him if it's not tidy by the time you go to bed, it's gone. Right. <laughs> Literally by nighttime, anything they leave on the floor, we just pack it up into a bag and just put it under the shed because like, well, you really don't want You know, it. I find also in addition to what you're saying that when you see things decluttered and clean and neat, it even gives your mind, it, 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 it puts you at ease, you know, when things are clear and clean cut and, you know, things are not all over the place, you know, it puts you at ease to even think properly, you know? Yeah. So it, it's great. Like even before, so I have a son as well. And before he goes to bed, like I'm like clearing all the stuff. And now as part of your course, one of the things I, I, I want to do is to take out his the bookshelf, replace it with a bigger bookshelf where all the books can go in one place, you mm-hmm. know, where we can access. So every when we're doing bedtime and I'm looking for a book to read. I'm like, okay, where's the, where's the book? Which book are we doing today? And it's, and then I keep some under his bed and I'm like, no, 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 this cannot go. So as part of the, the course I'm doing, I am going to sell the, 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 the colorful uh, cases that he has. And I'm going to buy one big bookshelf and put all his books in there, you know? And, and this is my next uh, uh, move, you know? Yeah. But because the declutter is, like you said, it's ongoing. I'm doing it. I'm just continuing the course, but I know this is my next step. Yeah. 
yeah exactly and then you see more space more you'll see more opportunities to create more space right. around you and you're like yeah. you never realize that wow i actually have so much space yes yeah you know and um I, t- I tell you something funny about decluttering because um growing up i was always around homes where the kitchen was full of pots and plates and and there was always never space right mm-hmm. so when i got married and i got my own home I think I felt like my cupboards should be full of stuff. So I don't even know where the idea came from. <laughs> oh it's not God. from me. Oh, I can relate. <laughs> but that's because I'd always seen that mm-hmm. there's always Pyrex dishes and mm-hmm. fancy stuff that people don't use and everything is always full. Um, so I felt like it should be full. Like this right. is how like a home looks. Right. And so my kitchen was quite full for a bit until I realized that I really don't like opening those closets, those cupboards, because the bowls will fall out and mm-hmm. it's so mm-hmm. full. And then you can't find the covers and you, it's all over the place. Yeah. I can't find the covers yeah. and I can't find, like, it was just ridiculous. So right, right. That, I was just like, you know what? We don't use it anyway. If we do, right. then we know. So we just got rid of so many things, setting new rules for ourselves. And now I get, I go into my kitchen and it's late we finish cooking it's late we want to put things away i can get a bowl and it's matching cover like straight away one second yeah yeah and not digging into things you know i'm not digging into everything yeah because yeah. i only have like 10 right <laughs> i right. don't have any more yeah oh uh, yeah. so it's it's it really helpful. it's definitely very right. time it saves time and it saves yeah. mental space and mental yeah. stress so that's great so yeah. Audrey, yeah. going forward, was there anything, I know we've not even finished the course, we're only halfway, but would there have been anything that was on your mind when you joined that you were like, I joined this course because I really would like to do this? Why did you join? And then I want to see that, I want to make right. sure there was something. So first of all, I was, I was invited by okay. my cousin. Yeah. Oh, awesome. And uh, we, we have been talking about how we're going to restructure like uh, in my income and trying to find um, another source of income from mm-hmm. what I earn already. I know I have the potential, but uh, you know, life gets busy. You mm-hmm. know, you have kids and a husband and things like that. It's just, it gets busy and you find excuses not to uh, uh, do stuff, but I know I have the potential. You mm-hmm. know? So I, I want to be able to, um, and also I know that I can, when I, if, and when I'm able to restructure my income and my money and know where all the money is going and stuff like that, have everything at one place and be able to look at it, I can then put it aside and say, okay, this is my network, la la la. I can now find a way to do open that business or do something to earn more, to earn yeah. an income, you know. Mm-hmm. Um, there's two things that I have in mind with regards to um, earning a second income. And that is, um, going to revamp, revamp my mom's business, my mom's existing business and doing something else of, of my own, which is um, uh, doing, um, uh, selling like lunch boxes and promoting healthy eating for kids. Um, yeah, so I've been wanting to do that for a long time. I just, I don't know how, where to start. I don't have the money. I think I, I, I don't think I'll ever get a bulk money to start. And so that whole sense of when you start a business, you have to have it in bulk. And if you don't have that big bulk, you will never be able to, you know, start. And so that's why I want to restructure my income and see really uh, if I can start slowly saving or I do have some money that I don't know, you know, I'm not able to, I haven't structured my life, so I'm not able to see it properly. Mm-hmm. So this is what, this is the reason why I'm, I'm, I'm here to see if I can, if I can hear you. That's amazing. Those are amazing goals. Um, yeah. I, I, highly is really important with regards to children's health and children's eating yeah. because it really yeah. does affect their future yeah so that is great um by hopefully by the end of this course you'll be able to answer more of those questions for yourself exactly. yeah. yeah yeah amazing yeah. amazing okay yeah. towards the end of the course the last um there'll be just one more check-in towards the okay. end and okay. that would be one-to-one. Anyone who okay. wants to book a call will get like a 10, 15 minute session okay. one-on-one. Okay. So um, okay. 
so we can revisit those okay. points. Um, if you wanted specific advice, you can always okay. send in the okay. question in advance. Okay, all right. <laughs> and um, we can go through that. Okay, sounds good. Yeah, um, do you have any other questions? Nope, so far so good. Uh, I've, um, I've got the information I need. And if I have any questions, like you said, I'll email you. Yeah. Oh, awesome. Awesome, Audrey. Well, congratulations again Thank you. Thank on you very much. getting this far and yeah. for sticking with it. Yeah. Uh, for, you know, getting your notebook and being enthusiastic. Um, yeah. Well done. And Thank you. Thank you so we'll continue much. to honor all your efforts. Amen. Well, well. Yeah. Yeah. So that's great. That's great. That's okay. Great. Okay. Would you like me to send this out as uh, this recording back? Would you like a copy or would okay. you, or do you prefer is, is not to share it out? No, no, I'm fine. I'm okay with it. Okay. Yeah. You can share and you can send it back to me as well. It's okay, cool. Just, just yeah. check in. No, no problem. Okay. okay. Um, have a great day. Thank you. Thank you very and much. And we'll continue day 16. <laughs> All right. Okay. okay. Thanks a lot. Yes. Well yeah. done, Andre. I'm, I'm rooting for you. Thank you. Goodbye. Okay,